Good evening, everyone. I'm Nicole Perez. And I'm Calvin Hughes. And here's a look at the stories making news on this Thursday night. A hot pursuit on the Palmetto Expressway. Police arrested a woman who officers say stole a silver Honda from a dealership in Doral. Employees at a Honda South say the woman asked if she could test drive the car, but instead she took off, sparking a police chase. It all ended when the driver tried to evade officers by jumping into a lake. Authorities pulled her out and handcuffed her. It's unclear what charges she's facing. And a man faces a judge for shooting a 16-year-old while conducting an online sale of a mini bike in Homestead. Officers say Ar Aureliano Gomez was one of four men, two adults and two teens, who ambushed a driver, his 13-year-old brother, his sister, and his friend. The driver's friend was in the back of the car when he was shot and taken to a nearby hospital. The 16-year-old is currently in the hospital in critical condition. A semi-truck driver saves a gas station from catching fire in southwest Miami-Dade. The driver told police the fire started after he filled his tank with diesel. It happened near the Exxon gas station on southwest 177th Avenue and Quail Rouge Drive before 3 this morning. He says he quickly drove away from the area to avoid the gas station from catching fire. The semi-truck was completely charred and the driver did have some minor injuries but refused to go to the hospital. And Amanda's recovering in West Palm Beach after he was bitten by two sharks. Marlon Wakeman says that he was working on a boat at a marina in Long Island, Bahamas, when he slipped and fell into shark-infested waters. The 24-year-old rushed to get back on board, but he says one shark pulled him by his head underwater. Another shark bit him in the leg and kneecap, just narrowly missing an artery. Despite his experience, Wakeman says he's looking forward to getting back to the water. As breaking news happens, we have you covered on air and online. You can always go to our website for more information, local10.com. Be safe out there. See you back tomorrow.